welcome back guys to another video without taking any much of your time uh, as you have seen from the title when you click on the play button the sim actually loads up it comes to the loading screen but for some reason the simulator automatically turns off so i'll be showing you what i'm talking about all right as you guys can see the sim automatically you know it turned on it came to this screen and as you can see it's loading this is the issue which i'm talking about here you can see it is at the 40 to 50 percent mark the issue is that the simulator is automatically it's going to turn off for some reason for some weird reason watch this this is what i'm talking about guys the simulator automatically turned off for some reason i tried to find so many solutions for it but none of it worked and it's not been you know publicly discussed as much as it should have been because it's a common issue which most of the people are facing so for this there are actually just like a 30 second process in order to, for you to play the sim i'll uh, just hold on i'll just show you what i'm talking about all right guys so as you can see there are the two things which you need to search okay i'll be providing you these two things in the description down below so check it out what you need to do is you have to first copy this Control C and paste it here. As soon as you do this, then the second thing which I've given you in the description, uh, copy this, paste it, and all these DLL files which you see, you just Control A and press Delete. That's all. Just press the Delete key. That's all you have to do. Sometimes it's not going to get deleted. It's going to show, but once you have pressed the Delete key, that's all. I just close this folder. Now watch this magic guys so we are once again back to the loading screen but this time as we have deleted those dll files all the uh, dll files which i've asked you to delete uh, now the simulator is not getting stuck at the 50 to 60 percent mark and now it's loading and uh, you're going to be coming on to your main menu screen of the game. So this was the easy solution, guys. I hope this video is going to help. Uh, you're going to find this video helpful. If you do find this helpful, just give it a like down below and uh, subscribe if you guys want to. Till then, take care, guys, and I'll catch you guys in my next one. Bye-bye.